Yes guys, welcome back to another video on the channel now. You can probably tell straight away that I've got a cold, so I'm so sorry for that. Apart from that, we are going to be doing a Pedro review. So pretty much, this isn't a player review where you play games and have a look how good he is in game. If you want that, you're going to have to click somewhere else. But this is more like a first thoughts, initial review. And we're literally going to go through everything from uh, show the stats, the SPC, the value, the similar players, strong links, and then like a summary if it's worth it. So it pretty much is if it's worth it to complete Mr. Pedro Flashback 86 uh, celebrating his first Premier League 2015-2016 season at Chelsea. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So then right off the bat, we're going to look at his face stats. 86 pace, 84 shooting, 84 passing, 87 dribbling, 48 defending, and 63 physical. Now he looks pretty good from those face stats and then you get into the first little uh in detail stats so you've got the four star skill moves and five star weak foot which is amazing obviously it's one star off it being perfect five foot seven so he's quite small medium medium which is okay it's not the greatest but not the worst um but five star weak foot is very very nice and then into the attributes here um obviously nothing on the spanish and that's uh roma by the way uh i think it's roma no it's a uh, lazio is it I think it's Lazio, yeah. Um, that is Lazio, the L. Anyway, into the attribute details, we've got 98 acceleration, but only 70 cent sprint speed. Bit weird. Um, 84 finishing, 86 attack position in shot power, long shots. Um, just going off the, uh, the main, main ones here. 88 vision, 88, 88 curve, 87 short pass, and then 93 agility, 93 balance. That is insane. 91 ball control, 88 the 84 dribbling and composure and 84 stamina there are his main stats he looks insane just based off those stats there also got the finesse shot trait which if finesse shots weren't like flipping uh overpowered enough they are now with this card and then the outside of foot shot so uh the five star weak foot can literally be left foot or outside of the boot on the right or anywhere on his right obviously and um yeah he should be insane at finishing those finesse shots though with the finesse shot trait and it being FIFA 22. He should be insane. But those are his base stats. Let's get into what you have to do for the SBC. Right there guys, according to Footbin, the price of the SBC is 89,750 on the Xbox, 86,500 on PlayStation, 87,950 on the PC. So it is relatively cheap, but um, you know, it is still a lot of coins at this stage in the game. But Here's why. So, a gold squad is required with 30 chem, so just you can use gold commas, whereas this one is a rare gold squad with 30 chem. Then you've got 83 rated Team of the Week players, 1 and 80 chem. Um, you've got 84 rated team with a Serie A player and a Premier League player, 75 chem, so still quite high chem. And then Spanish players, 1 with 85 rating and 70 chemistry. So, overall, if we look at the SPC prices, um, this is on Xbox now. Um, let me just go over to it here so if we look at the prices we have got um, here we go yeah here we go so we've got um, a gold squad coming in at 6k and then we've got a rare gold squad coming in at 8k top forms 20k past and present which is weirdly cheaper I think it's because of the team of the week but I didn't think it would have a, a massive impact um, yeah, it's coming in at 19k, and then we have uh, a premium gold pack for the 35k SBC um, of La Furia Roja. Um, so that's the 85 rated team. So in total, it reckons about 90k. So I think it's quite quite expensive at the moment, but 90k for this sort of card is very good value for money, in my opinion, because he's got great stats. And we're going to get into the players similar to him and his links, and you'll see why it's going to be a pretty good value SPC. So then, guys, the players that are going to strong link into uh, Pedro are going to be Lazio players and Spanish players. Sorry, that's in my club. So looking at the Lazio players, we've got Immobile. So he's actually quite a good player. Three star skill moves, four star weak foot, uh, high medium, uh, decent pace, and absolutely amazing shooting, good dribbling as well. So a nice strong link there. Milinkovic Savic lacking pace, but he'll be a very, very good card on the game. So good, good links there. Uh, can't directly link them without playing them off chem, but uh, Felipe Anderson's Team of the Week card is insane, so that's a good one. Uh, featured Team of the Week, I think. 
Um, Luis Alberto is awful. Asirvi is awful. Uh, Lazari is okay, but he's on the wrong side of the pitch. Um, and then like Lucas Le Leva, Strakoja, and everyone else are, I'd say, pretty bad. You don't really want to be linking anyone else there. But then we can also have a look at, which haven't got much options, so... You know, it's kind of lacking, but Syria Spanish players will also strong link, and we've got Morata, who's all right right now, but even then, he's he's not he's not that great, guys. And then Fabian's bad, Calion's bad, Delafu has got pace, but he's on the same position. Odriozola, you can't really link to; he's got pace, but apart from that, guys, you're really lacking. Um, there aren't many strong links to Pedro. So chemistry wise, it is kind of hard to link him unless you have Serie A players. And obviously there is tons of good Serie A players, just not many good strong links to Pedro. So that's something to consider. And then in terms of similar players, we can have a look at left mid, left wings, left forward, stuff like that. So we'll, we'll ignore icons. They're out of most people's price ranges if you're going for these sort of SBCs. Coleman is a very similar player uh, in terms of rating and uh, good good sort of uh, nation but Coleman's more pace less shooting more dribbling but someone like Hyunmin Son who's I think worth a lot more than uh, well I, I know he is uh, but obviously he'll be tradable um, five star week for four star skill moves he is very very similar good shooting just really well rounded good shooting dribbling passing pace um, m way more quicker probably better finishing and shooting overall um, well, definitely better shooting. Um, passing, I think, goes to Pedro. And then dribbling goes to Pedro as well. So, pace and shooting to Son. Passing, dribbling to Pedro. And then, who else have we got in the left mid? Rashford is more pace, but good shooting, good dribbling. And uh, I think Rashford's more expensive. Could be wrong on that one. Um, Carrasco isn't anywhere near as good. So, left mids from there don't get anywhere close. So similar players is looking like Son at the moment. Um, left wingers, we have got Mane, who's more pace, but you know, four star, four star, good shooting. I think Mane's probably a bit better. He's absolutely rapid. Sterling's uh, way quicker, but Pedro is like better at shooting and dribbling. Insigne is someone who or I would consider similar, apart from the shooting. Insigne is like small, good dribbling, good passing very nice player and is very cheap way cheaper than uh, Pedro so it's something to consider similar players Insigne, Son um, a little bit of Mane but not too much but there aren't too many similar players like him and uh, obviously he does look very good on, on paper so yeah pretty good right then guys to round off the video I'm going to give my overall view on Pedro is he worth it? I think yes um, if you can fit him in your team Bearing in mind that Immobile is pretty much the only good, like, major strong link and uh, Milinkovic Savic. And then, if you can uh, afford him and, yeah, fit him in your team, I do think he is very, very good for the price. Um, 90k for this card. He should feel insane. You've got to give him something to boost up that sprint speed. And then, maybe a Hunter to get the shooting all the way up as well. I do think Pedro is going to be a very, very good card. If you are planning on doing him, let me know in the comments down below if you used him. Was he good? How did you perform? Let me know. If you're new and you liked it, subscribe, like, and yeah, peace.